Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And um, some have found that a leak happened for Microsoft. Their RTM or release to manufacturer version 24H2 of Windows 11 leaked online. And some people got a hold on it and grabbed it, installed it, and apparently it's right now a lot of a lot of problems. So from blue screens of death without being able to recover to all sorts of other problems, including .NET framework failures. Um, Halbacore, one of the Twitter or the X users that uh, we follow, it has a lot of info, is talking about how he's been having a lot of problems, and here's talking about uh, RTM base 26100.1, broken 64-bit .NET framework app debugging. And blue screens, there's Zach Bowen have uh, Windows Central that is also going crazy about uh, his PC. He installed the 24H2 build, just has a lot of issues. So this is supposed to be the RTM, and of course we're still a little while away from maybe them sending it, which is supposed to be this month though. And it makes you wonder if maybe 24H2, which is a really big update, isn't going too fast into pushing the updates and the new features without them being fully tested. And I've said it again and again. One of the things that they are not using and that is available is us insiders. We are, and the Canary in my case, the Canary belt should be normally being there, should be at 26100. They should have sent it out to us. And this is his right now. But still, tons of things are not yet uh, showing up as new features. So it's working just as its basic form, but anything that has new features, apparently tons of problems. I've been have I had a blue screen here today actually on this machine, which doesn't happen very often. And uh, so 26100.1 is RTM, um, nothing special in it, which is kind of interesting too. Uh, we'll see what happens with the features when they do appear, uh, all of the new features that will be cool to have within Windows 11 24H2. But right now we are um, basically not having... Uh, a good time, and uh, this is this happened with 23H2. We I made a video last year, uh, maybe a month, month and a half. You know, will 23H2 be plagued with issues? They seem to have worked it out, but I think there needs to be more testing done, and the feature should be pushed to users. It's for some reason they're holding on to them, as uh, they maybe don't want us to see them before the build event. So hopefully they're going to fix this, and it's not going to be a nightmare for 24H2. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.